Hi folks, uh, today I've got a uh, Brinks Home Security Commercial Grade uh, Model 672-50811, uh, which is a very nice looking padlock, certainly. It's got this nice engraved logo, you don't see that very much anymore. Uh, stainless steel shackle, tells you uh, the packaging says all sorts of things about superior cut and corrosion resistance. It all looks very nice. Um, but uh, that keyway isn't so great. Sort of a scaled up master lock keyway. Here's the uh, key. You can see there uh, six cuts on it. And uh, this thing does have spool pins in it, so should give us a little bit of fun here. Uh, now because that keyway is kind of narrow, I'm going to use uh, a very thin Peterson pry bar. Put that seated in there. And there we go. See, there's a little bit of a range of motion there already. And uh, we're going to use a standard thickness Peterson hook. And we're just going to start by going all the way to the back. And we're just going to start feeling around for a binder. Yeah, I think that was number five or number six. Uh, keep feeling around. Okay, nothing up front wants to go anywhere. Let's try in the back again. Okay, that was number four, number five. Feeling around, this feels like a number three, I think. Alright. Back again. was number three or number two. Okay, that was number three. This is number two we just set. And number one is the only thing left. And there we go. Oh, not bad. Uh, it does have a uh, just standard spring-loaded latch there. It's double latching, so you might be able to shin this, but uh, it does uh, offer a little bit of a challenge to pick. So uh, this is going to go off to Rick Kershaw Moore along with a replacement for one of his other Brinks padlocks which uh, got broken recently. And uh, because these are American made locks, they're uh, quite a lot cheaper to get here over than uh, in England. So until next time folks, have fun and happy picking.